we are all traumatized. Trauma in our soul is caused by an event that overwhelms us. Our thinking, our ability to feel, and our will are no longer in balance and our being becomes disorientated and dysfunctional. Traumatic events happen every day in children's lives. Domestic and gang violence, physical, emotional or sexual abuse, illness, death of a beloved one, accidents, natural disasters such as floods, storms and fires, loss of a home, acts of war, poverty and many more. We respond to emotional shock with flight, fight, freeze or camouflage. An ancient survival mechanism in which the amygdala, a small area in our brain, sends out the command to protect ourselves. Our heart beats faster. We breathe faster to pull more oxygen into our lungs. Our muscles fill up with more blood and we start sweating to cool us down. This is all preparation for enabling the human body to survive a threatening situation. Depending on the level of available inner resources, we can digest the traumatic event and return to normal moderately quickly. If we do not have these inner resources to digest the traumatic wound in our soul, we can't heal. Vulnerable children in vulnerable communities lack these resources. Anxiety, anger, loss of control, re-experiencing the trauma in flashbacks, nightmares, trouble falling asleep, changed appetite, headache, stomach ache, vomiting, bedwetting and loss of trust are normal reactions after traumatic events. Unhealed trauma manifests itself as us continuing to experience these symptoms even if in a safe environment. At the Butterfly Art Project, we offer children safe spaces to build the inner resources to deal with trauma by using art as a medium and to prevent post-traumatic stress disorders and its associated symptoms. It is all of our responsibility to create safe spaces for children and adults where survivors can experience rhythm and routine to stabilize. Conversation for sharing feelings and stories. The sharing of information around the traumatic event to prevent feeling guilty for what has happened. And most importantly, for free expression by playing together, creating art or creating a ritual for healing.